My name is Helen Mary Cowart. I've been at New Covenant probably going on three years, I think. And I am a teacher at Montessori Elementary School of Asheville. I have first, second, third, all in one classroom, 20 kids from six to nine years old. And um, what I love about it is it's looking at the whole child. So we really work with them on taking care of themselves. Um, as far as their work ethic, their choices, and then also the classroom and other kids in the classroom, and then the world beyond that. Montessori really feels like each of those kids is created for a special purpose. And so we're there, a big part of it is just to observe, and not teach, but observe and follow the child. So traditional school is sit down and let me pour it into you, but Montessori is more let's watch, let's see what you're created, what your potential is, and then let's follow that and let you cultivate that. And the one thing you'll see with Montessori children, they love to learn. They manage their own time. They have about three hours where uh, we've talked about what their priorities are, what their goals are. Uh, for the day, for the week, and then in between me giving a lesson to one child or several children, they choose where they want to work, they choose who they want to work with, they choose what they want to work on. I have been a teacher since 1991 when I went to China and started teaching college students English. And when I went there, I really just saw the opportunity to invest in people's lives through helping them improve themselves. And so then I've been in teaching since that time. My ministry isn't just I go and do ministry. When I was a young Christian, it was like, let's go and do ministry. But it's part of my life so that when I walk my journey, it should be everywhere. Of course, I'm far from that. But when I walk, when I walk my journey at school, the way I show my walk is one with my boss. I feel like, you know, if I watch out for his resources, I do my best job. I, I honor him as my authority. Also with the parents, really being honest with them, being, um, I mean, if you think about it, a teacher, I spend more time with their kids than they do. So I take that very seriously. And so I show them that and I work hard and they know that and I'm committed to talking to them and helping them problem solve and just being there to be encouraging and kind with them and not to judge them because it's easy to judge parents and go, what's their problem? But to really know that they don't know what they're doing any more than I would know. And then the child, of course, you know, I mean, just loving them and really observing what their strengths are and following that. That's Montessori. Really my ministry is prayer. And like, you know, with my prayer cards, I put all my kids' names on them. I pray for those kids every day and the parents. And I've realized that's really sometimes all I can do. That's all I can do. I met Helen Mary through New Covenant's Life Group program, and she is an excellent teacher for discipleship. I think part of the reason is that she was trained by navigators, and discipled by them, and she's just, she has the ability to take difficult things and make them easier to understand and to digest. I think that she makes New Covenant richer because she is a healthy single woman and I want my girls to be able to see someone who um, is able to do single well and to teach my children that they can trust God with whatever He asks from them. The things that I've appreciated about New Covenant are that one, and you've heard this in other videos, that it's just a place you can be real and you can sense that when you come in. So I think it's a good place for me where I've been able to really be real and heal. And really, even though I've been a Christian since the 80s, really still grow in my walk. And also be a place where I can disciple others because I really have a heart to disciple. It's one of my gifts is to teach. And so I, I think that's been encouraging. Plus the small groups that I've been to quite a few small groups and met a lot of people and uh, really made connections. Um, but I think the biggest thing is I've met others that were like-minded and that we can be accountable to each other. And then um, just the, the Bible studies that I can be in. Thinking about what New Covenant could do better. After being in China for four years with no church, 
not having options, coming back to the States where we're very spoiled, we have so many options. Really at New Covenant, I don't see anything that we could add. My ministry to 20 kids and all their parents and my boss and all my coworkers, it is all for one.